Hey guys, welcome back to No Catchy Name. It's me, Ella. Today is Friday, July 7th, I think. <laughs> and today is my first video for the Christmas Extravaganza. This is a collab hosted by K and K Crochet, which is KK and Kristen. I'll link them down below, so check them out. <laughs> they have a ton of videos already for Christmas Extravaganza. And I'm going to be putting out one every Friday this month. So my first project, uh, the theme of Christmas Extravaganza is gift ideas so you can start working on gifts now for Christmas <laughs> so that you're not overwhelmed by the time the holiday season actually gets here so um, I was trying to think about good little little gift ideas that you can make pretty quick and one of the first things that popped in my head was bookmarks <laughs> for people who love to read I thought maybe you know you could buy someone a new book and then include a homemade bookmark I thought that'd be a cool idea so I looked up some bookmark um, tutorials <laughs> on YouTube and I found two that I thought would be easy for anyone to do and they're easy to customize. So the first one that I made is called Crochet Flower Bookmark by Crochet It. And I used two different weights of yarn. I used worsted weight, which is number four. And then I used number two, which I think is sport weight. <laughs> I can't, I'm not sure if it's called sport weight. Um, to just try two different sizes. <laughs> and I used an E-hook, which is a 3.5 millimeter. So here's the worsted weight one. So it's got a flower on one end. And the other end is a little heart. You would stick it in the book you know and you can customize if you buy someone a book you can do as many chains as you need to put into that book or you can do just like a generic size you know so there's the first one this is the worsted weight one this is the sport weight one so it's a little bit smaller it's pink <laughs> so that was the first pattern i'll link both of them links below the second one is called easy do-it-yourself crochet bookmark by crafting with kayleen and it's kind of a flower pattern. It's not, it doesn't say that it's a flower, but it's kind of like a flower or sunburst. <laughs> so here's the worsted white one. It's got this, this little thing on each end, like a sunburst looking thing. Again, you can customize the length of the chain as needed. And this is the white two one, two way one. It's blue. So I made four bookmarks. <laughs> and I, they're really quick. I made them all at the same time. And there's no sewing other than your ends. It's all connected, you know. And it'd be a cute little thing to include in a new book for someone or to even put in like a little bag and put in a stocking or something like that. Just a cute little gift if you know someone who likes to read to, um, you know, include <laughs> in their stocking or as a gift or whatever. And also, uh, there are like a million bookmark patterns. <laughs> These are just the two that I found that I liked. So, um, Ravelry, Pinterest, Google. Uh, and YouTube have tons of them. So you just type it in and it'll bring up all of them. And uh, they're just really cute. I was going to make one that was like a corner page one. But um, I felt like it would be too thick to be actually function functional. Uh, but I don't know. Maybe. But I like these ones better that just go into the book. So these are my first <laughs> Christmas Christmas extravaganza projects. I'll leave them both linked below. And I'll leave K&K Crochet links below. So check them out and all their videos. And there's a bunch of other people participating too. So I'll check out all the people. <laughs> and uh, yeah, I'm going to hop off here and I'll see you guys in another video. Bye guys.